let's talk a little bit about the solubility of methane, that's CH4, in water and then some other solvents. If we look at methane, CH4 here, we have the carbon in the center surrounded by the four hydrogens. And you can see from the model here, the center, the black, that's the carbon, the hydrogens, those are the white. We have a tetrahedral molecular geometry. There is a small difference in electronegativity between the carbon and the hydrogen, but all of the hydrogens are pointed in different directions. So methane, CH4, it's a nonpolar molecule. When we put it in water, which is polar, it really doesn't interact much with the water. So when we look at the solubility of methane in water, not very much dissolves. In fact, it's 22.7 milligrams per liter. That's really not very much. But what does dissolve, here's our methane here, temperature goes across the bottom this way, it's increasing, and then solubility as you go up, solubility increases. Methane is soluble, the colder the water, the more methane is dissolved in water. And as you increase the temperature you go across, methane, it becomes less soluble. And that's the case for all of these gases. As we increase the temperature, they become less soluble. There is a link in the description and at the end of this video describing why that happens. But in answer to our question, this methane, CH4, it's virtually insoluble in water. Some does dissolve, and the amount that's dissolved decreases as temperature increases. Methane is soluble in other substances. We have like ethanol, diethyl ether, benzene, toluene. These are either nonpolar or have a nonpolar component to the molecule. So that's the solubility of methane, CH4. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.